and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lindsay. I sell part-time on Poshmark and also The Real Real. And I post mystery unboxing videos every Monday and Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern. So if you do enjoy that type of content, please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to hit the like button for me and also the bell notification so you are alerted every time I post a new video. Today, I'm going to be opening a thread up box. This is a fun box that came from Phoenix, Arizona. And I ordered this one pretty recently. I have some older ones that I haven't opened yet, but I thought I would go for this one in case there's any Christmas items in here so I can get those listed soon. And I did get an invoice. And let's take a look. Yes, this was ordered on November 18th and it runs $34 now plus tax. These do ship free for me. And we do have a lot of clothing um, type of pieces in there. I thought this might have been a designer when I first opened it just because of the amount of clothes, but it is a fun box. And the first item is brand new. Um, it is George and it's just a little black knit beanie. And um, that had a $2.92 price tag. So that will not be worth reselling. Um, so I'll probably just hold on to that. And next we have some kind of scarf here. And it's kind of a light gray um, and white tie-dye. Yeah. So I have been getting some more scarves in these boxes lately. Um, this does have, um, no, it's just a orange little tab. I don't see any branding on it. So um, something like this, um, I will probably not list, but it looks like it's in nice condition. So let's see what else we have. This is Victoria's Secret, brand new, um, $20 tag on it. And it's um, like a bralette and it's kind of got like a fishnet type of appearance, a little overlay. There's no underwire. So just kind of a lounge type of bra. And um, this one is uh, just a size small. So that can definitely be listed. I'm glad it's brand new. Uh, next, I have a pair of Cuddly Duds. Um, this is a kid size thermal. Uh, two piece set, a top and pants. And the retail price has been taken off, but it is an extra large. So that can definitely be listed as well. That would make a nice gift. Um, next, I have a pair of sandals in here, and these are Union Bay, which is a Kohl's brand, I believe, and they are size six, and they are not new, but other than the bottoms, they look like they're in, you know, very good condition. There's some markings there. So those can probably be listed. They're not gonna go for much, but something I can still list. Um, next I have some um, headbands and scratch mitten set for babies. And this is um, Bon Dormer is the brand for a little girl. I am not familiar with that brand, but that um, should also be able to be listed. Cute little pattern. And next I have, looks like this is like a kimono or something. It's really soft. Like a white uh, with a doily kind of sleeve. It looks like there was a waist tie that's missing. 
um, but it is a really soft material. I don't see any branding on it. So that is again kind of unfortunate. I'm not sure what I'll be able to do with that one. And next I have some Jane and Bleeker slipper socks and these are massive. There's two pairs here and um, they are for a shoe size four to 10. Really big cozy socks. So at least you get two pairs with those. I don't know about that brand, but they look pretty nice. They're like a chenille, one with, um, you know, multicolor and then just a plain black. And they do have the little grippers on the bottom. So those are good. And I got um, a jewelry piece here. This looks like it might be a men's bracelet. Kind of like the... Uh, watch link kind of look. Um, it's a gunmetal silver and there is some wear on it there. And here's the clasp here. So I do not see any type of branding on that. So I don't know if that's something that would be worth listing. I've never sold um, men's jewelry before. So I will look into that one. You know, so far I don't think this box is too great. You know, there's a couple nice pieces in here. Um, next I have a, another bracelet and this is a silver tone with a purple cabochon. And it is a magnetic closure. Um, this is by the brand Plunder. So that is a good brand. They're, I'm not sure if it's intentionally kind of distressed looking on the silver or if that's wear to it. But it looks like it's pretty generously sized. So that's not bad and that brand is pretty good I think. And lastly, I have some hangers. So these are nice. Um, these are St. John hang-ups. And, you know, those might be even nice for, um, you know, listing items on Poshmark. So I will check those out, but you get a pack of five of them. So those are nice. I mean, hangers are not cheap, so, you know, even if these, I mean, St. John, I don't know if that's like our designer brand, St. John, or if this is something different, but either way, you know, those would go for something, I would think. So we have the hangers, the plunder bracelet, the men's bracelet, the Union Bay shoes for four, five with this gray scarf, Six with the socks, seven with the no name robe, eight with the baby headbands, nine with the cuddly duds, and ten with the Victoria's Secret, and eleven with the hat. So I think I will definitely be able to make some sort of profit on the box. There's at least um, quite a bit of brand new pieces that I'll, I will be able to list, um, but probably a couple things in there that will just be a donate. Um, let me know what your thoughts are, what item you like the best. I appreciate you tuning in and I will see you back on Thursday with another video. Have a great day.